Hello and welcome back to The Hype Educator. Today we are starting a series. It's a survival guide for teachers prepping us for getting back to school. Yes, summer break is almost over and it's about that time. So you know what we want to do. We want to start strong so we can finish strong. My name is Nikia Hopkins-Sullivan and I am The Hype Educator. And I like to share just a little bit about my journey with you. So for 25 years, I've had the joy and the privilege of owning a dance school where I choreographed for competition teams and ballet, tap and jazz, and I ran a vibrant summer camp. Dance has always been a passion of mine and it was an incredible experience to guide and watch my students grow and succeed in their performances. Transitioning from the dance studio to the classroom, I found a new passion in elementary education. Over the years, I've taught third, fourth, and fifth grades with a special focus in English language arts. My belief is that literacy is the key to unlocking success across all subject areas. I've consistently seen significant growth in my students' reading and writing abilities, and I attribute much of this success to making my classrooms engaging and my commitment to utilizing data-driven strategies to support their development. In 2023, I was honored to be named Teacher of the Year, and I hold a specialist degree in teacher leadership from Mercer University hey, and a coaching endorsement. Last year, I achieved the highest reading growth in my school and this was a testament to the hard work of my students and the effectiveness of our strategies that I am here to share with you. So beyond the classroom, I extend my passion for literacy as a YouTube literacy coach. Through my channel, I aim to provide valuable resources and insights to fellow educators like you and parents like you helping to foster a love for reading and writing in students everywhere. Okay, so enough about me. We are starting to dive into all things classroom in the first week of school prep. Today, we're tackling a topic that adds a touch of responsibility and fun to our learning environment, classroom jobs. Classroom jobs are not just about assigning tasks, they're about fostering a sense of community and responsibility among our students. Plus, they can help us as teachers manage our to-do list and reduce the stress. Again, this is going to be a hype, stress-free year, so we're going to do whatever we need to do to keep our teaching hype. Having classroom jobs teaches responsibility, promotes teamwork, and gives students a sense of ownership in their classrooms. This also means fewer tasks for us to handle alone allowing us to focus on what truly matters, teaching and connecting with our students. Now, let me show you how I'm creating our classroom jobs poster using Canva. And did you know that Canva offers Canva Pro for free to educators? It's an amazing resource. Please check it out and get it. I go into my account. I do have Canva Pro. I am choosing to change my background. I want to do black because I want my colors to pop. So I chose black as my background. And now I'm going to go ahead and go through the element section so that I can choose like a label to put at the top. Classroom labels. Okay, I like this one. We'll stick with this. I want to click my text box. Let's go into this text box and let's give it a title. Since I'm making a poster, I'm going to do my poster size, just so you know. Make sure that I have my text pop in everything, okay? Let's put in here, classroom jobs. Okay, so now I want to choose what font that I want. I'm choosing the colors that I want. And I'm trying to keep it children friendly, decent print. So let's see. I think I'm going to go ahead and settle here. Let's go ahead and change my line spacing. I'm enlarging. Let's make this a little bigger. Excellent. Okay, so now I think I am going to go in 
and make little folders. I am going to make little folders and that's how I will label what each job is. And because it's on poster, I am going to use, this is just my preference, so I can change out the jobs easily. I am going to use a dry erase marker. We could write the names in for that week, however often you change your jobs. And then, and then I can erase them. So it's really easy, okay? Sure. I like these folders. Okay. So we're just going to size these bad boys up. Now I'm going to go ahead and put in white labels. I'm going to put white labels on each of the folders. And that is where I will use my dry erase markers to write in the names of the student. And I think above that, I will go ahead and put what the class job is. Now, the great thing is this is going to be completely editable. So at any time, if I want to change the jobs, I can. But I am going to print this off. And I think I'm going to do something special for you all at the end. So you want to stay tuned to the very end so you can see what offer I have for you. Okay. Now, this is where I'm going to go ahead and put in jobs that I know are more frequently used. These are what I typically typically use a lot, okay? Now, whatever you need, hey, that's what you would put in there, okay? So here we go, changing that out. Let's go ahead and do this fast. All right, so as you can see, I am leaving one blank. Just in case there is something that I realized through the year, hey, I need this job to be done by my students, so I can always write there what I need. Okay, but these are the things that I need in my class. I'm just going to clean this up some, make sure everything is lined up nice and perfectly and centered. I'm going to change the color on my label so that it can match the folders a little more. And you know what? Now this thing is complete. I'm going to save it. I'm going to save it and I'm going to save it as a PNG, but let me show you what I'm going to do. So this is how I'm going to print mine off. Now you have the option. If you have the option at school, at your school to print off posters, do it. It's free. Okay. But something else that I like to do is I like to use Walgreens. Okay. So shout out to Walgreens. They always have a special, like consistently have a special on their photos. So I would print off my posters for my room at Walgreens. It's so easy. Most of the time it's ready the same day. The same day I can pick up my poster. At the most, maybe the next day. Now that I have everything sized, I'm going to my checkout area. I chose a 12 by 18 because I want this to be pretty large in my room. I put in the code that was available for my area. So you see it knock it from $14.99 to $7.49. That's not bad. Now, again, you could do this for free at your school if your school has a poster maker. But I'm just choosing to go ahead and get mine done because I just want it ready. I don't want to wait in that line. So I can pick mine up at my Walgreens store for free, which is right around the corner. Or I can choose to have it shipped to me. Either one. Offering this customizable template as a free download on my website. Check the link in the description below to grab yours. By implementing these jobs, we ensure a smoother year, helping us become true hype educators who enjoy our jobs and foster an engaging, supportive classroom environment. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell, okay, for more back to school tips and resources. Let's make this school year the best one yet. Start strong so we can stay strong.